nice design object. It has the same effect on me like the sun, for example. You know, it's something that, that really excites me. Beautiful design just matter, um, and it, it does something to me as a human being. My name is Mette Hay, and I'm one of the founders of the Danish um, design brand Hay. We are in Hay House, uh, which is our showroom and our flagship store. It's in the center of Copenhagen, and it's a place where we have guests coming from all over the world, and uh, everyone is, is welcome here. For me, it's really the perfect place to show what Hay is about because as a person and as a company, we are not so good with words. Uh, we are better in showing what we are doing and how we, we want things to be, to be seen. I knew since I was a child that I wanted to work in this business. I grew up in this industry. Uh, my parents, they had a, a design store in, in Jotland um, since I was 13 years old or something like that. I really loved it there, so, so it was uh, definitely my parents who introduced me to, to this uh, world. This business is the nicest business to be in. I think uh, all people working with designs are, you know, like very passionate people. Um, it's a special crowd and, and I really love that. My husband and I, we, uh, we started Hey. Um, it's almost 20 years ago. I was only um, 23 years old at that time, so he have in many ways been my education. We felt like there was a, a huge gap in the design market. We could see that a lot of the furnitures and design pieces that we uh, loved, we couldn't afford to buy it. We had this dream about making products for our own generation. Uh, made by designers from all over the world in an affordable price level. That was the starting point from, from the beginning. Um, we also wanted to make stores and showrooms which were friendly. And I, I, I think the, the furniture business um, at that time was a little bit more conservative. Back in time, many furniture company in Italy worked with Italian designers. Danish manufacturers work with Danish designers and, and so on. In this new global world, you know, like we, we, we want to work with people from all over the world. And uh, it's for Rolf and I, it, it's always been like it, it doesn't matter who you are, where you come from, as long as the product is, is the right thing for, for Hey, then, then we want to work with people. There's a kind of a story behind each product in our collection and, and every story is, is different. It's about how we meet with people or sometimes it can be a design language or product that Rolf and I have seen and then we get in contact with this person and we really, really love to work with people that we admire. My work today is always with people. Um, I think the only time when I'm alone is when I'm answering emails and uh, people would know that I'm not very good at that. <laughs> I think also to get brilliant ideas and it always comes when you are together with other people having conversations about design or product. After many years of, of doing this, it's still like seeing a first prototype or meeting a young talent who have designed something special. It still makes my body react in a very positive way. 